All right, I thought I would just send you a really fast video on how to change the ticker. I mean, you're more than welcome to email me as well, and I can change it for you, but sometimes I don't get to it as quickly as possible. So basically here, here it is. Once you log into the, into the back end, into our uh, uh, portal, you click on the pages section, and the template that does your weather and everything, that's in this first pages section. We just go all the way to the right, and this is here, so we click on it. This brings up our graphic design editor. And then you can see in here, I'm just gonna make the window a little smaller so the box comes up and we can see the bottom. So in here, basically very quickly, everything is its own individual layer. So if you wanted to swap out your logo, you just click on it, select your image from your local C drive. Um, weather is fine, it's just our weather app. Uh, if you click on the ticker across the bottom, this brings up our ticker app. And again, anytime you click on something on the screen, the menu on the left will change uh, related to the item that you clicked on. Again, these are all individual layers and I can grab it and I can move it wherever I want. Um, we'll just put it back. It's a little bit sticky. Uh, yeah, and then you just click in this box here. This is where your ticker information is. You can either type in what you'd like um, or uh, cut and paste from Word or something like that. And then there's a few other items you can control, whether it comes in on a new line from the top to the bottom. And anyway, all that kind of stuff is fine. You can add some shadow if you want. There's all, a whole bunch of stuff in there. Anyway, once you're happy with it, you just click uh, Save and back to the dashboard. And then your shows that are running on your TV through the channel section here will automatically update uh, and play your information. So if you want to see what it's playing, you just click the little eyeball. Uh, and if you want to copy that address to walk it over to that computer, that's your dedicated web address there. So you would just uh, open Google Chrome on the TV, uh, computer that's attached to your TV, play that web address and you're good to go. And if we click on it, well, it's gonna open full screen so you're not gonna be able to see it. So I'm gonna end the video there.